Hello fitness friends, welcome back to Dan Zeke Fitness. For those of you who are new to my channel, welcome. I'm Desiree and I create videos to help you all achieve that long, strong and lean dancer's physique. All of my workouts are either Pilates, bar or ballet based. So if any of this is of any interest to you, don't forget to click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of my workouts. For today's workout, it's all about ballet bar basics. So whether you're an experienced dancer or you're just starting out with your ballet training, this video will be perfect for you. We'll be working on proper body placement, leg and foot alignment and articulation, musicality, and of course, we're going to learn all the terminology. All right, now before we jump into this, I do wanna take a moment to talk about proper body placement. So let's all just stand up nice and tall with the legs and feet in a parallel position. And I want you to think of lifting up through the crown of the head, your chest is open and wide, shoulders are down, and think of opposition. So you're pulling up, but you're pushing down into the floor at the same time. So the feet are nice and rooted. Your tailbone is going straight down to the floor. We don't want to tuck the pelvis under or tilt the pelvis back so we want the tailbone to go straight down and of course that belly button is pulling in and up shoulders are stacked right over the hips so talking about the legs we should be able to draw a straight line all the way down from the hips through the center of the knees down to the feet now when we externally rotate the legs from the hips the same thing applies the hips support the knees which support the feet don't turn your feet out any more than your hips can't support a lot of people force their turnout we don't want to do that that's not good and as i said before we're not tilting the pelvis back or tucking the pelvis under belly button in and up tailbone goes straight down to the floor so we're standing up nice and tall at all times all right guys now that we have the proper body placement basics let's get into it all right let's start facing the bar feet are in a first position light hands on the bar and take your demi plie and stretch plie means to bend so we want to bend those knees keeping them in line over the feet and now we're going to go into a grand plie so we pass through that demi plie go all the way down heels come up and then we push the heels down as quickly as we can to come back up and let's tendu to second demi plie make sure that tailbone is going straight down to the floor we don't want to tuck under or sit back and now grand plie in your second position the heels stay down in second good and push the floor weight to come up and let's point the right foot and we're going to cross either in a third or fifth position so if you can cross your feet all the way that is a third position if you can cross your feet all the way like me you're in a fifth position grand plie straight down push the knees and thighs back and then press those heels down as quickly as you can on the way back up let's tendu and we're going to cross the right foot in the back now so now your left foot's in front in either your third or fifth position good and grand plie lift up as you go down knees back push the heels down pass through that nice deep plie Good guys. Let's point the left toes to the side and close back to our first position to finish. All right guys, let's move on to our tendu. So starting in first, working the right leg, we're gonna work through the toes on the way out and on the way in. And demi point, full point, demi point, close first and out and in and out. So we're really working on the articulation of the foot and we'll take a nice demi plie same thing side demi point full point demi point close first and demi full point and demi close first and then straight out straight in good guys so really make sure that you are keeping both legs straight and then we take our plie to release same thing to the back really working all parts of the foot demi point then point all the way to the toes on the ball of the foot and close and work the foot out and in keeping those knees straight good and take your demi plie to release and we go one last time to the side good 
Lots to think about here. Keep pulling that belly button in and up. Tailbone is dropped straight down to the floor. Shoulders remain over the hips. Long neck pulling up through the crown of the head. Very nice, guys. All right, and bring the arms down to finish. Good. Same thing on the other side. Here we go, working that left foot. Work through the toes on the way out and on the way in. Good, knee stay straight and close and tongue do out and in really working that foot along the floor good and take your plie knees over those toes good guys keep lengthening the leg good also think about the leg that you're standing on that leg should be so pulled up and engaged super super long Plie, same thing to the back. Good. And close. Work the foot, point the toes. And close and lengthen the leg. Tendu, good. Really stretching the leg out nice and long behind you. Good. Make sure the upper body's not twisting. And last set to the side, keeping the shoulders over the hips. Nothing moves but that leg and foot. guys and take your plie to finish and good work all right guys moving on to degage so demi point full point lift tendu demi point and close and then we brush to our degage so just like in a tendu there's many things that happen so we're working the degage in sections demi point to your tendu then we lift up to the degage lower back to tendu demi point and then close back to first so all of that beautiful articulation that we did still has to happen we're just lifting the legs slightly off the floor good so this is our degage depending upon which technique you learn some teachers call it a jeté good really brushing the foot using the floor and of course both knees stay straight for this one as well a lot of people make the mistake of relaxing their knees on the way in so make sure you're brushing the leg straight out and then closing the leg straight on the way in as well all right bring the arms down to finish and let's try it again this time with the left leg work through the foot demi point full point lift lower down work the foot and close nice and then we brush good energy shooting out of the toes straight out and straight in and straight out and straight in good same thing to the side try not to twist the body good brush that's nice and brush good really feel the energy all the way from the crown of your head to the tips of those toes good this is all about the length we're never gripping our muscles our muscles are engaged but we're also thinking about the length because that's what ballet is about making the longest lines possible good guys and close a nice first and then we brush it out good and brush and nice finish good job guys so now we're going to take all of our tendus and connect them into a half circle tendu front open side carry back close first this is called a rond de jambe good so we're making half circles now let's reverse it backside front close first backside front close first again both knees stay straight same thing on the left front side back close first and again front side back close first reverse your circle back side front good just lightly dragging those toes on the floor to make your half circle and close first good guys let's take our demi plie we're going to roll through the feet lengthen the legs up and roll down with control 
good so this serves as a nice stretch for the feet for the arches and let's reverse it press up plie roll down with control and press up plie push over and roll down with control good guys let's elevate up which means we just press up without bending the knees Press up, knees stay straight, lower down, knees stay straight. And now we go into a releve, which means we plie and then go all the way up. So an eleve is straight legs. A releve means you plie first. Good, guys. Test your balance and we'll finish up nicely. Let's turn the legs and feet into a parallel position and we're going to work on our coupes into our passes. Good. So we peel the foot off the floor. This is a parallel coupe. Drag the toes up to the knee. Passe. And we lower back down. Good. Let's try it with the left. Articulate through the foot. Bring it up. Lower back down. And roll down toe ball heel. Coupe. Passe. Coupe. Toe ball heel. Good, guys. Rotate to your first. It's the same thing, but now those legs and feet are externally rotated. Toe ball heel, peel the foot, coupe front, drag the toes up to the front of the knee, lower back down to your coupe, roll through the foot, toe ball heel, left leg, through the foot, passe, coupe, toe ball heel, again roll it up, drag the toes up, good, and lower down, toe ball heel, alright guys, good work. Bring the legs back to parallel. Let's try faster. Coupe, passe, coupe, roll it down. Good. So this is all about the beautiful articulation of the feet that we worked on. Good. Same thing with the left. Really roll through the foot up to your passe and let's rotate to our first. Good. And if you like, you can lift that right arm off the bar. Same arm as leg just to test your balance and switch to the left. Passe. Coupe, roll it down and coupe. Good, very nice, guys. Woohoo, isn't that a fun one? <laughs> All right, guys, good work. Let's prepare tendu flex, frappe. And pique, 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 bring it in. Frappe, halt. Good, so frappe means to strike. So we're hitting the floor with the ball of the foot. Flex point and little pique, so you're just tapping your toes to the floor. Good, try it with the arm the second time if you'd like. Make sure for those piques that you're moving your whole leg as a unit. So the knee stays straight, the toes stay pointed. You're just moving the leg from the hip joint. Good job, guys. All right, let's take our plie, and here we go on the other side. Tendu, and we'll flex the foot, strike the floor, and hold. And little sharp piques, good. And strike, hold. Up, 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 and strike, hold. And lift, 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 and strike. Good, and now let's try with the arm. So arm is up when your leg is to the front. Again, keep those shoulders down. Arm is to the side when your leg is in second. And the fingertips are right in front of the nose when your leg is to the back. And again, we open the arm to the side when your leg is to the side. All right, guys, finish with a nice plie. I'm going to swing around here so I can face out. And here we go for our grand butt mas. So we're kicking the leg to the front, lower back to your tendu to close. Very nice. And brush, and close, and brush, and close, and brush. Both knees stay straight, just as we did before for those tendus. Good. And brush, lower the leg down with control, articulate through the foot, and brush. Close first, and brush. Good, two more. Very nice, all right guys. Let's see if we can release the bar and let's work on our port de bras, which means the carriage of the upper body and the arms. We're gonna open the right arm, open the left arm, try to follow your hand with your head. Take a little breath and lower the arms down. First position, and high fifth position. Open the left, this is a high third. Open the right, now we're in second. And we take a little breath and lower all the way down. 
and finish very nice guys let's face the bar we're going to try the same thing to the back brush to your arabesque lower to tendu close first and brush lower to tendu close first and brushed just pass through that tendu as you close good both knees stay straight stay nice and square try not to twist now you can lean a little forward with your upper body, but make sure those shoulders stay level and you're leaning equally with both sides. We don't want to just lean with one side and twist the back. Good, guys. And let's roll up through the feet and we're going to try that same port de bras this time on our releve. So you have to really hold those legs and ankles nice and strong. Good, and we'll come down. Let's releve up again. Arms go to first, high fifth, and we'll open the left arm to high third. Open your right arm, now we're in second. Take a beautiful breath, and we'll finish in a nice plie. Great job, everyone. I hope you guys really enjoyed this ballet bar basics. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And if you have any questions at all about any of the steps that we did, please, please, please don't forget to leave me a comment down below. I am more than happy to answer any of your questions. There's just so much to know when it comes to ballet and the whole technique behind it. So please do not hesitate to ask me any questions. Thank you guys so much for your love and support. It really, really means the world to me and take care of you and I'll see you guys in the next one. All right. Bye.